in these intellectually, emotionally, spiritually perilous times. But the mass media is throwing huge quantities of lies at us. And we turn to the alternative media and find alternative huge lies thrown at us. The mind becomes gripped by journalistic, existential, intellectual passion to uncover the truth and is kept tossing and turning, kept from sleeping at night by the agonies of unanswered questions. Like, what is the true almond content of candy-coated almonds? I finally embarked on my quest to find an answer to this question. I took a knife and sliced away the external consumerist mass media coating of the outside of the candy-coated almond, separated the presumably healthy, touted as a possible treatment for everything from acid reflux to Parkinson's disease, Parkinson's disease almond core. Then I took these respective components to my admittedly possibly government-influenced and conspiratorial post office where I had them weighed. The numbers came out as 27 grams for a sample similar to this one of purified almonds, 60 grams for the lemon-flavored icing sugar coating, for a total weight of 87 grams, and a total content of 31% almonds. This begs the question, is it ever possible to beat the consumerist mass media brainwashing system when buying almonds? which, when candy-coated, are admittedly often much cheaper than straight almonds. These ones were 74 cents per 100 grams because in each consumerist marketing cycle, some almonds are left over, unpurchased and blown out at bargain prices. These have now been replaced by fall-themed almonds, which sell for, what, $1.90 per 100 grams. But... How cheap would they have to get what, for it to be worthwhile to strip away the deceptive outer coating and get at the core of the truth? Well, at this point it's not worth it, but at one point in the past they had an abundant oversupply of candy-coated, yogurt-covered, Christmas-themed almonds, which were blown out at the bargain price of 34 cents per hundred grams. And at that point, yes, it would have been cheaper to get one's almonds by buying the oversupplied Christmas surplus almonds and stripping away the interior coating. <laughs>